and you're trying to catch it. So it's it's just so hard to hard to put to scale what I mean, I mean those grid fins are the size of a car. Yeah. And they're so far up there that nothing makes sense. Yeah. <laughs> it's a gigantic rocket. I mean it's five thousand tons at lift off. It's the largest flying object uh, ever made of any kind. And you're trying to catch it. Yeah. <laughs> catch it with Mechazilla arms. I was actually slightly inspired by Kong vs. Godzilla. Yeah? You know Mechazilla? Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's the reason for this? Well, the, the reason, yeah, the reason <laughs> for, for the, uh, like I said, there's, there's, there's many ways to solve this problem. Obviously, you could do it with landing legs. Uh, the problem with landing legs is you, if you, well, you've got the weight of the landing legs, mm -hmm. you've got to protect them on entry, especially mm -hmm. for the ship, that's tricky. Yeah. And, uh, and then you've got to get a, a giant rocket from where it landed back onto the pa onto the launch stand. Yeah. So I was trying to think of what is the in the limit the uh, most efficient, most rapidly reusable architecture would be that the thing that lifts the rocket onto the pad is what catches it. What catches it? 